everybody, it's Maggie with Lead and Love K9, and today I'm going to talk to you guys about a really fun training drill called the Paper Plate Recall Drill. And this drill, I think, was introduced uh, a long time ago by a very well-known, well-respected trainer by the name of Dick Russell. It's a drill that combines three different training commands. You have your sit stay, your send away, or what I call the go get it command, and also the recall or the come command. And it requires a pretty sophisticated piece of dog training equipment. Looks like this, simple paper plate. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna use the paper plate. You can use other objects too, in fact, um, in my demonstration, when I get Jinx, my little min pen out here to demonstrate this, I'm actually going to be using a metal dog bowl turned upside down for my target. But originally the drill was taught with the use of a paper plate for your target. So you're going to put your dog in a sit stay. You're going to go out to your target and drop a little treat on the target. And then you're going to return to your dog, give him the send away command. I use go get it encourage him to run out to the target, get the treat, and the minute he's gotten his treat, you're gonna recall him to you by saying come, and when he gets to you, you're gonna give him another treat. So it's really fun, it's a food drill, it's a great way to build um, awesome engagement with your dog, and you get to practice three different things. So let's go ahead and bring Jinx out here and have a little fun with the paper plate recall drill also known as the metal dog bowl upside down drill here at Leading Love Canine. Let's have a look. So here we go. I have Jinx um, starting out this drill with him sitting relatively close to the target. I think when you're in teaching mode, you wanna start out close to the target, especially if your dog is struggling a little bit with the sit stay. This means if he gets up, you can just put him back into a sit pretty quickly. So I set him up over here, have him go into a sit, walk to the target, drop the treat, go back to him, tell him go get it, and then immediately call him to me. I also want to point out that it's really important that when you're recalling your dog to you, that you walk backwards a little bit. It just helps to keep them motivated, and it reinforces that come means keep coming until they're right in front of you, just like that. And as you practice this with your dog, you can get to a point where you can move further and further away from your target. Here I'm going out to the end of the six foot leash, sending him out. And then right here, I'm actually going out even further and dropping the leash. So he's really getting a good opportunity to practice the okay. sit-stay. And I had to help him a little bit there. That's uh, really common in the beginning when you're teaching your dog this, that the further you get away from your target, you might have to give him some extra encouragement that, you know, the go get it means to actually go get it. Okay. Here he does pretty good. So I hope you guys have fun with this. Please drop me an email if you have any questions and I look forward to hearing from you.